What's shaking y'all? Welcome back to EECraft. How you doing today? Totally. Uh, yeah, we're gonna make some things. We're gonna try some stuff. Uh, I did a little bit of revamping. Um, let's see. Made a tank. So I need some lava. Made a bed. It's made out of pretty green lime wool. Uh, changed this into a... Uh, it, it looks like an X-Wing fighter. But uh, it's just... Uh, Oh, well, that sucks. That sucks totally, I'm sorry. Uh, but I'm glad I can help a little bit. Um, yeah, uh, one side with ore, one side with cobble. I tried doing something fancy, um, like three, like three tall, three at a time kind of thing, and I don't know, it just didn't work out right. It was just, it just was overkill, but... Like, if I can just do this, you know, kind of thing, this is just easier than... Because I had it where, like, you could hit, like, one, two, three blocks at a time. But, uh, it just made it problematic, that's all. So, yeah, we did that. Uh, let's see. What else? Been planting some trees. These are jacaranda. Uh, I made myself an axe. Called the dumb. Um, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna try to build a house. I think. I think I'm gonna try to build a house. But uh, I don't know. So I've been planting like. Let's see. I, I did mahogany. I did. What else? I did mahogany. I did some cherry wood. And I'm doing jacaranda. I don't know. We're just gonna use a lot of weird things, I guess. Let's see if I can get a magic sapling to plant. I don't know. Does magic sapling have weird looking wood? I don't think magic sapling has weird looking wood. I'm gonna plant a uh, biomes of plenty redwood. See what that does. Do I sell bone meal? Oh, I do sell bone meal. I don't know if this will grow if it's just one. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's gonna grow if it's just one, is it? What if you gotta plant those four by four? Doesn't say, does it? You got Enderman? Nice. First time you got an Ender Pearl, nice baby. You're going crazy over there. For whatever reason, you get peaches from those things. I don't know why you get peaches from those things, but you do. Uh, okay, so let's make... I want to see... I want to work on these things. I want to see what I can get with this stuff. So I'm going to throw down some dirt and uh, make one of these uh, soil enrichers and see what happens. I'm just going to be curious, that's all. So I need dirt, two diamonds, and a bucket of water. Dirt, two diamonds, bucket of water, bucket of water. I also made the uh, this thing, pocket portal, and uh, builder's wand as well. Uh, my water source is down here. Go. Better not be a waste of diamonds. I only got so many. Alright, let's grab some more dirt. It's called a blood skeleton? A bad skeleton. A bad skeleton. Huh? It's actually called bad skeleton. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Alright, so I made it a lot wider down here. I made it all the same size basically so that's what these pillars are here for just so I could figure out correctly the right size oh, alright so let's put some dirt down let's just do something simple five let's do a five by five because if this thing does 
more than a five by five, then I want to know. Two, three, four, five, yeah. Well, look at that. It's doing things. Oh, that's cool. I like it. Here, let's put a bunch down then. I wonder if it'll stay vitalized soil or if it's like. Like if you can break it as vitalized soil and it'll still be vitalized soil. Oh, look, it is. It's getting way out here. Oh crap, alright, so that means it's probably going to be a 9x9. Nine nine. I'm going to get as much vitalized soil as I can get. Ow. That said it had charges? Charges, it does have charges. Oh, that means... Okay, 15. Is it at 15 charges? That must mean it can only do 15 of these. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 20, 21, 20. No, it can, can do more than that. I guess it's just a time. Just a time period, I guess, as opposed to an amount. So it's not a one to one, that's for sure. Well, the trick that I want to know is can I break this and have it still be vitalized soil? See what happens. I don't have like silk touch or anything. If I did, I definitely eh, wouldn't put it on a shovel. Let's just break one, see what happens. Nope, just dirt. Just dirt. Okay. Might it might be different if I had silk touch. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. So I think the first thing I want to do is plant a blaze rod. Where they are. One, two, three, four. Let's see if see if this is how it works. My first blaze rod. I'm so proud. Okay. Blaze rod. I don't know if I need water or anything for this stuff to grow. I don't know what, what I need. Can I make a watering can? Diorite, andesite, stone. Yes, I can make a normal watering can. What are these? Thermal cultivation watering cans. Irrigates farmland and speeds up plant growth. Correct. 
What is this? A particle cylinder. From the mod Nice. What is that? A particle cylinder. It does sound interesting, doesn't it, Goose? Oh, look at that watering can. Holy crap. Invar. Copper in a bucket. There's no book explaining what this is or how this works, so I don't know. What is this? Satin drops. Doesn't say how to make these, so I'm guessing. What a license blaze rod. I guess we'll just leave it, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. See what happens. Let's go make a watering can. Should we make a thermal foundation one? Or should we just make the cheesy one that barely works? The cheesy one that barely works is kind of annoying. You can bone meal it. <laughs> I wonder if you can bone meal it. I got a bowl too, don't I? Somewhere? Yeah, I got 13 of them. It reminds me, I need to place another uh, thing. Not there. There. I need to put another strainer in here. This watering can is very poor. It's better than nothing, but it's very poor functions poorly. Nothing? What's shake it's doing? How you doing, man? is even doing anything so I don't know I don't know anything about this mod maybe we should look it up let's look it up real quick I'm looking up this mod because I'm not sure exactly what's supposed to be happening did that did that Oh, you can, uh... Careful of drop plants, use a plant to provide a summary, click on the soil with a hassle mob drop. Bone meal plant and wait for it to fully mature. Once fully mature, the plant will sprout bulbs on top that correspond to the drop in the soil underneath. There's a chance that the soil may revert to dirt. Planters slowly revert to dirt. Oh, that kind of sucks. But you can bone meal this? Okay, it's in the configs. Apparently it's a config option that you can bone meal them or you can use them for other things, but apparently I cannot bone meal them. I'm doing all right, Stone. Uh, yeah, just doing some new things. Just learning new, new things. We planted a blaze rod. We're gonna see what happens. Uh, let's see. Because I can use the pocket thing. The pocket thing. To make all sorts of stuff. I don't have any melons. I didn't get any melon seeds. All these crazy seeds I got, no melon seeds. I don't know, I'm trying to come up with ways, more efficient ways here. Let's try a, a gunpowder. 
don't think gunpowder is really that big of a deal. What else do we have not a lot of? I can plant a wither skeleton skull, right? I think I can plant a wither skeleton skull. Yeah, there's a wither skull bulb. Oh, loots. Uh, I didn't have it turned on. It's uh, it's not set up to my uh, it's not set up to my Twitch stream anymore. It's set up to my uh, YouTube stream. I never switched it over. Um, I pretty much just stopped using it. I mean, in general, because people weren't doing it no more. The loots. So even if you did do one, it uh. It, it would only show up on my YouTube stream. Unfortunately. So, I think I'm gonna try to do something at some, at some point. Uh, building a house as a base on a sky block. I haven't done that in a long time. I haven't done that in a long time. This is very disorganized. Alright, uh, we gotta go back downstairs. Here, screw it. Let's plant. Let's plant our one wither skull. Should we should we do that? Should we do that? Colossal chest. Now, colossal chest isn't in this one, I do not think. Um, how is it? I mean, it's not bad. It's okay. I mean, it's you know, it's a death generator. 150 RPA tick. No, that's cool. Um, it's it's got a lot of mods in it. Um, I think they could scale it back a little bit, but. Uh, Blink skull. What do I need for wither seeds? Skeleton chunks. Wither skeleton chunks come from solid survival strainer, which is just a bunch of iron. Maybe we'll do that. There's a peach up there. Um, yeah, I've only done a, f a few episodes of it, so like four streams worth? I'm just running around in circles. Uh, this watering can is useless. Um, let's just hook this back up for giggles. How did the mahogany wood get in there? Does this thing just suck things in that you throw out in there in the water? Why isn't that an option? Why can't, what happened to right click and just tossing one out? What happened to that? Why is that not a thing anymore? It does, it just sucks it in. Oh, okay. Did not know that. There, get stuff. Get stuff. Um, EE Craft isn't bad. Uh, some of these things I played with back in 110 when that was a new thing. Uh, what? Well, oh, yeah? What'd you do? I forgot what I requested. Ah, oh, nice. Um, uh, make... You said you made a farm already? You said try to get all the trees. So like one of these, like this, this is a, uh, I've, I've seen this part of it, but these things, some of these things are new. Like this is new, this is a new part of the, of the mod that's in it. The mainly the sky resources thing. 
honestly, you should be able to. There should be a way to do it. Build a platform in the nether and try to get some things to spawn. Yeah. It's like a lot of these things are, are, are different. Uh, like, let's see, these things, these rock crusher, rock cleaner, okay, so some of this stuff is different, uh, especially the way the metal creation works. Uh, the alchemical fusion table, I think it used to be different. Um, and the fact that it just kind of bypasses a lot of the stuff. Uh, like, this started with me fishing, but if you land on the, on the grass one, you know, like, that one's different. Like, the fishing one is different, I think. I don't think they had the fishing one before. Um, I like this feature. This feature of red, hitting this thing with redstone, and, use it, and that's how you get ores, kind of thing. I think this is a better way of getting ores than the whole alchemical fusion way, but if they had just done it one way or the other... Like, if they got rid of this part, and just did this part... Or if they just did this one and got rid of that part, I don't know. Uh, it would make it a lot harder. This would make it way more resource intensive, and you'd probably need uh, a more in-depth mob spawner. Because as of right now, like because of the ores and there being creeper ore and stuff like that, like I don't even really need to kill these guys if I didn't want to. They are a source of wool, and those little mob drop things, those little life essence things. Oh, god, I just put that on my head. I like it. <laughs> yeah, the ex nilo I, I, I can't, I can't stand ex nilo I, I don't, it's so overused that I just can't stand it anymore. I don't want to play things with it anymore. Unless I absolutely 100% have to. And if it's in the pack, you know, whatever, that, like, nerf it or something, you know? Make it less uh, solely based on nothing but sifting. Like, your entire pack is based on sifting, you know? Sifting, not shifting. Uh, yeah, and I said sifting. Sift. S-I-F-T. Because sifting gets boring. Because once you get to the point where... Okay. I'm not. I'm explaining it to other people. I'm explaining my, my point. Because I feel... There's... Oh, I didn't put ooh, I didn't put any light down there. Oops. Uh oops. There's a skeleton down there. Hey buddy. Yeah, hi. Where are you going? Where are you going? Yes, I did just get meat from my cobble gen. <laughs> and fish, and string, and everything else. Um, that's what I was trying to, that's what I was getting to here. The, the fact that they have two different ways of, of generating ore in this pack. This thing, I still don't know, I still don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with this thing. Like, am I just waiting for it to grow? I don't understand, I don't know. Um, So yeah, so they have this thing called Fun Ores? Fun Ores, I think it's called? Yeah. So there's pig ore, fish ore, cow ore, chicken ore, rabbit ore, sheep, squid, bat. I haven't gotten any bat ore yet. Or squid ore. Zombie, skeleton, creeper, spider, enderman, slime, witch, zombie, ghast, magma cube, wither ore, blaze ore. Guardian or you can get all of these things like this just from here just from applying a redstone signal to a cobble gen uh, and that's what gets you <laughs> all this stuff eggs uh, you get sugarcane blocks from it as well sugarcane blocks you get 
all this meat. <laughs> I got rabbit, mutton, chicken, beef, all this fish. Uh, spider eyes. I haven't killed a single spider yet, but I got 19 spider eyes. Uh, you get rotten flesh. I've even gotten wither. I got wither dust. That's where I got this wither skeleton skull from. Uh, all sorts of things, man. And it's kind of it's kind of crazy. So, you know, string, rabbit hide, leather, feathers, gunpowder. Yeah, I definitely won't starve. And with this thing that I just stuck in here, this uh, strainer, uh, you know, I'm getting all the saplings I can I can get. Uh, it gets me sand and dirt and gravel and tomato seeds, you know, whatever. Uh, what's the fast food? Fries, sunflower seeds, grated cheese, cheese, tomato, beef burger, beef patty. Huh. Churn, a meat grinder kind of. Yeah, I've been eating the clownfish. Because you can't cook the clownfish. Just gotta eat it raw. Uh. But yeah. So, it's got this whole process. Okay, so you need this machine, this machine, this setup to make ore, right? To make one ore, or well, not even ore, one ingot, right? Uh, and you need all of these ingredients and stuff, right? To make this, to make one ingot, or cobble gen and a redstone signal. Cobble gen with a with a lever. Fish ore, witch ore, creeper ore, wither ore, nickel ore. Redstone. Like, once you get to the point where you can mine all this stuff, this will even give you obsidian too. So, <laughs> you can get pretty much whatever you want, but you're kind of at the mercy of it. So if you need a lot of iron, and you have to leave it up to just, you know, RNG, praying that you get some iron to pop up, and then once you mine it, it doesn't pop into the lava, you know? At some point, you're going to want to probably set up a block breaker over here, which maybe we'll try at this, at this point. We'll, we'll try a block breaker. Let's see what happens. I don't know if the block breakers are... I know they're bugged in some packs, but... So, all sorts of fun stuff from that. Not that. So yeah, so I got, I got prismarine shards, prismarine crystals... Um, I th yeah, that's Sky Resource, I think. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me think about this. Uh, sugarcane. What's a sugarcane blocks? Oh, that's Quark, okay. Um, I don't think this is Sky Resources that does that, because Sky Resources has this process. The metal creation process of the fusion, the fluid droppers. That is uh, something different. It is something different. What is it called? It's called something. not attained drops. That's what I'm doing downstairs. What is it called? This has Da Vinci's vessels in it. Da Vinci, Vinci. <laughs> I want to say it's X-Parvis. I want to say it's X-Parvis, which is like an X-Nilo knockoff, but different. Multi-storage, music craft, mystical, agroditions, I don't know, football glider. I want to say it's X-Parvis. Personal cars, you can get cars. Okay, maybe it's not X-Parvis. What is it? I know this. What's a 
flare torch. Throw a torch. Flame damage on hit. Shift plus jump plus right click. Release torch rain. What? It's an item to forcefully delete the light source at nighttime only. Please right click on the ground several times near the light source you want to erase. You can change the deletion range of the light source from configs. What? What is torch rain? I'm fascinated. I want to know what torch rain is. I have a feeling that I'm not going to be able to figure out what it is in here because it's not going to have an item. It's literally just adding a redstone signal to to it. But I want to say, I really want to say it's Exparvis that does that. Because it seems like it would be... Gravel ores. How do you get gravel ores? It doesn't say. So sure such as mod salt XP. Simple item collector chest. Simple item collector chest. What does it do? There's a guitar stand and an amplifier. Guitar and a drum kit. What what's the car mod? It's a personal there it is. Look at these things. Our tools gonna make a timer piss and push out the ores and won't fall in love. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, there's lots of ways. When I first when I first figured this out, that there was lots of ways uh, that you would need to like automate it to make things way more easier. So you wouldn't have to. Uh, it was an SUV. You wouldn't have to sit there and just mine it all day. It would do it for you. Car engine, block of iron, car wheel. Car wheel's an ink sack. Does this run on gas? Helps loading animals in helps loading animals to a car. It's also a nice punishment. You can put animals in the car. It's a chunk loader. Yeah, cars don't seem useful in a skyblock. Just like this has craftable, uh, this has craftable horse armor in it too as well. I'm like, when's the last time you needed a horse in a skyblock? Uh, I want to see if anything comes up for portal. End portal core. Creative energy source. Frame teleporter and portal. Are these craftable? These are not craftable. Yeah, yeah. I tried doing this on a regular world, and it was just it was kind of uh, redundant because you could just go mining, or you can build a cobble gen and and do it like this. Use this source. Using the sky resources on a regular world just seemed weird. So it's got the deep dark. I think it's got caverns too. I think there's a cavern world in this. No? No cavern? Which one was that? Something I was playing had caverns in it. Uh, Alright, what was I doing? What, what do you want to do? You want to try to see if we can make a block breaker? Let's see if we can make a block breaker. I probably have to build a... Uh, I'm going to need an RF source, probably. Uh, let's see. Auto. Auto breaker. 
Yeah, I'm gonna need the, uh, whatchamacallit. The, uh, blah, blah, blah. This thing. Atomic Reconstructor. How much iron do I have? And why is there a torch there? Oh, that's another kind of annoying thing. This thing will automatically place torches if you have them in your uh, hotbar. Right. I need to get this stuff out of my inventory here. Too much stuff in inventory. Okay, uh, Reconstructor was lots of iron, so... Now what do we got for generators? Let's tech it. Um, if you want to play something with a lot of tech and a lot of stuff like that, I would suggest uh, All the Mods Expert Mode. All the Mods Expert Mode is a fun pack to play. It's just hard enough to be super rage inducing and uh, also fun to play. Um, what should we make? Just a cheesy old survival generator? I think that'd be enough. We could do a culinary generator. We got tons of food to pump into it. Oh, also, uh, totally. This, uh, this pack, hey baby, this pack, uh, has very consistent mob drops. So, zombie. Zombie's gonna give you pretty much the same drop every time. Uh, that time it didn't give me anything, so never mind. But here you go, creepers. <laughs> creepers will give you the same drop just about every time. Oh, really? Eh, whatever. Age of Engineering? You can try Age of Engineering. That seems to be pretty freaking popular. So every time you kill a creeper, you pretty much get a head, an inferior essence. Lime wool, TNT, and gunpowder. Every time you kill a creeper. Every time you kill an Enderman, you'll get a potion of night vision, uh, at least two Ender Pearls, and sometimes some black wool. Uh, so it's got really consistent mob drops. So because of that, I have I have a lot of lime wool. And a lot of white wool, because you get that from uh, your your sheep ore. Uh, gray wool comes from uh, the basalt sometimes. You get purple wool from witches, black wool from the Enderman. Uh, brown wool was just random. I got that from random uh, thing. You haven't got to the end game yet? Uh, yeah, everybody, I, I, pretty much everybody I know is playing that pack. How you doing today, baby? You having a better day? Or having a good day, anyways? Maybe we'll do a culinary generator. We got a ton of food. And we don't have to worry about stuff like that. Let's do a furnace generator, furnace, machine block. That's a lot of iron. Eek. I don't know if I have that much iron. Uh, I have stone on me, I don't need that. Uh, I do have enough prosperity ore to make a uh, seed. We just gotta figure out what kind of seed I want. I don't know what seed I should make. Any suggestions on what my first seed should be? I'm still trying to figure out how this thing is doing down here. It's still not doing anything. I don't know like what I'm supposed to be doing. Like I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing something or, or what. Look at this is all fish. So much fish. Uh, Alright, uh, we needed what? We 
needed machine block, chest, redstone. Now I'm wearing a creeper head. Nice. Uh, so he keeps telling me I've run out of torches because I have a torch in my in my inventory, but not on my hotbar. So it's constantly telling me I'm out of torches every time because it wants to place one every time I I click on something. Look, watch. See if it'll, see if it'll do it. Yep, there it goes. <laughs> That's just a little obnoxious. Yeah, it's understandable, baby. It's understandable. Uh, all the mods. There's an all the mods three for one twelve. You know, that's just kitchen sink, everything that they could possibly put in it. And those guys are usually pretty good at uh, working out any like crashes and things like that, so they keep it well maintained. Uh, what was I in here for? What was I in here for? Redstone. I needed redstone. Um, I needed to make a chest. Am I out of chest? No, I have an extra chest. Needed the iron. Let's just do this. You, 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 thank you. You, you, thank you. And then some form of combination of food. I don't have any carrots. I need wheat. I got wheat. Does it need to be cooked? Does it need to be cooked? Okay. Alright, we got a culinary gen. Now the only thing I don't know is, I guess we can just put it on the back with the block breaker. The block breaker keeps everything in its inventory, doesn't it? Don't let it just pick up. That was weird. What did I just pick up? Alright, so we got power. Oh, uh, the atomic reconstructor. Oh, that's what I keep grabbing. Gotcha. Reconstructor. What's that? Oh, recording. Eight more iron. Why you? Why can't I break this? Do I gotta cook it? I do, I gotta cook it. Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of a it's kind of a low like a low period right now, I guess, for uh, mod packs. Folks like trying to get you know waiting for 112 to to kind of come into its own kind of thing and waiting for a little bit more development to happen and stuff like that. And that's totally not what I was supposed to be doing, right? No, not even close, right? It's iron, not redstone. There you go. 
So it's kind of one of those times where it's just like, eh, people are playing, like, I, I've been seeing people go back, like, uh, I've, I've been contemplating going back to 1710 just to, like, kill some time, like, playing some packs. Like, I've, there's a couple people I know, uh, Trionis, Nicole, BW, uh, going back and playing, uh, 1710 packs. Alright, I need a, uh, lever. I've actually been wanting to, uh... Can't, I can't get up there. I've been wanting to, uh, play around with, uh... Well, the rest of the torch, the toggle. I think I gotta switch that, don't I? I have, I have stick and stuff. Like, I've been contemplating just going around and messing, doing a couple streams with, uh... What is this? Pulse, deactivation, pulse, deactivation, pulse. Yeah, I want deactivation. Uh... Anti-material energy. It's been like two years since I played that pack, and I loved that pack. Even that, maybe even going all the way back to 1.6.4 and playing uh, some running red. I don't even know if that's pack even if that pack's even available anywhere. I'm gonna have to play that on like the feed the beast like original launcher kind of thing. Uh, okay, so then what is it? Coal. Coal is a void crystal. Okay, turn off. I should just do a block, shouldn't I? It costs the same amount for a block as it does. Yeah. Good point. Good call. That's why I got you guys around, right? Hey, look, I got a book. Ooh, there's a basalts down there. This is another thing that these guys are good for. These guys just drop a uh, crushed obsidian. Free crushed obsidian is a good thing. And balls rods. Balls rods that are basically pointless. See, pulverized obsidian for free. Running red is on curse? It is on curse? Nice. I want like a fence post there. I want something there. I don't like that it's just hanging free because that's not I don't think that's gonna work so we gotta do it like that eh. Eh. it took forever Block breaker. What if I just type in breaker? What else do we get? Oh, Phantom long range. That's right. Auto breaker. Yeah. I guess that's our only choice. Uh, we need redstone. So four redstone. So redstone block. Redstone block.
What else? Cobblestone? Really? Just cobblestone? Auto breaker. Now the trick is to get this thing placed so that it's actually breaking the cobble. It's actually breaking that thing and not pointing out. Wrench, yeah. What is it, actually additions? Laser wrench. Extreme wrench. The most extreme wrench ever. This has funky locomotion in it too. The only person I've ever seen use funky locomotion is uh, Direwolf. Yeah, I guess we're making that. Just a bit as a wooden wrench. Smart wrench. What if you can use the smart wrench on everything? I'm looking for the cheapest one to make. The laser wrench from Actually Editions. Why, why do I need a laser wrench? Oh, that's just for lasers. That requires red dye. Why? Why does that require red dye? No yet. Yeah, there's no yet a wrench. There's no Ender IO in this. Yeah, I'm gonna try the cheapest and go up. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. There we go. Smart wrench. We got a smart wrench. <laughs> okay. Uh, sneak. Right click to pick up machines. Right click to rotate machines. Yeah. This one's not working. That one's not working. Looks like the uh, smart wrench isn't as smart as you think it is. Smart wrench apparently only works for RF tools. I know, right? You get you get like so like. They just recently added Tinkers to this too, and I'm a little upset by that because this pack started off without Tinkers, and uh, I was kind of looking forward to that. Tinkers makes things too freaking easy sometimes. Okay, uh, let's do this thing. Let's just finagle things a little bit. Here we go. Get behind here. Bam. Almost. Almost. And this thing doesn't need RF. Nice. Hey, look at that. Okay, now we need a torch. <laughs> now we need to turn it off. <laughs> uh, lever, please. Thank you. Um, I want to put something underneath here. This doesn't have a vacuum chest or anything like that. But I don't know if it's going to pick up everything. I wonder if this will just auto output. Or if I need... What do I need? What do I need? I need a... Uh, doesn't have conduits. Pipe? Transfer pipes. Transfer pipes should work? I think transfer pipes will work? Yeah, transfer node. Uh, 
that just regular glass? Yeah, regular glass, stone slabs, redstone. My baby. These are all the same. Something spawned in your hand? Yes. Interesting. Yeah, that's what I said. Uh, they don't have conduits, so... I totally forgot what I needed. Glass. Yeah, glass. This is a new feature that I really enjoy. The whole, I can put whatever I want in here, and then it's, when I click out of it, it doesn't just pop out into the environment. It goes right back into your inventory. That's an excellent, excellent feature. And Side. From the side? Yeah. What you mean? From the side that has the, all the stuff. Be like careful. That. Like that. Jeepers. Yes, you can. I can. Yes, you can. So I can get it really, really quickly. Yes, you can. So I did that one. Okay. <laughs> did you build yourself a house yet? Yeah. Good job. Did you ever build that boat? Yeah, well, build a boat on the sky block. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I need a chest to put all this crap in. What's well, shaking, Katie? Thank you for the follow. How you doing today? What kind of chest? I need a chest. Chest. Creative chest? No. Large memory chest? What the heck is that? Thank you for the host! I appreciate it. Uh, framed? No. We could just do a normal whatever diamond chest, I guess. I'm doing alright, Katie. <clears throat> Crystal chest? Well, thankfully, it's not a lot of diamonds. Sorting crystal chest. It's a reinforced diamond chest. What's that all about? Quantum storage. Uh, crafting. This is diamond to crystal chest upgrade. That's just obsidian and glass. What? Wait a minute. Oh, that's so you don't have to use the actual chest itself. I get it. I get it. I like that they have, you can use glass instead. Save some resources. That's kind of nice. Uh, Alright, so... I need a normal chest, thank you. Ooh, let me get uh, some sand. I need some glass working. Uh, drawers. Drawers. Yeah, this has drawers. You get so much stuff from this. Like I said, you get all of these fun ores and stuff, so you're getting mob drops and everything from this, so... It probably would be just easier to put it all in one spot and then filter from there, as opposed to a wall of, of chests, a wall of, you know, drawers. But I guess we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Like I said, I kind of want to put my house over here. <laughs> like, all this stuff I'm going to, like pick back up and move at some point. That's why I'm farming all the weird looking wood. I 
Yeah, like you did to your house, Goose. Alright. Iron. You know, I don't think I've ever made a crystal chest. I think I just stopped a diamond, just never bothered with it. Um, iron chest. I know. I, I really like the fact that I can just throw some glass in there and have it be okay. Watch it be disabled. Yep. <laughs> Watch it be disabled. Watch it be like, no, psych. Accepts any block glass. Yeah, no. Psych. Fooled you. I need more gold then. Oh, gold. 11, 12, 14, 15, 16. Get out in. Thank you. Totally just did that. Where is my coal? See, I'm very low on charcoal. I don't want to use my coal. I need to make some charcoal. I need a tree farm too. This is going to fill up so fast. <laughs> There's so much stuff you get this way. And some of it you get way more than others. I'm guessing the sugar comes from the witch ore, I'm guessing. A chain of double chests, yeah. Uh, I have no problem with, uh, I have no problem with just making a, a big chest. I'm gonna need it. Uh, let's see, so iron to gold is that. I don't have enough gold yet. Thank you. And then gold to diamond is that. stuff. Yes, I got a trip wire. Probably from the fish whore. Oh good, it breaks obsidian too. I was wondering if it would break obsidian. It's so much crap. Well, this is easy mode now. This thing doesn't even take RF for God's sakes.
No, oh, why are you cooking charcoal? What does that give you? Alright, that does give you graphite. This has extreme reactors in it. Did not know that. You know what, I get yellow right, I should have figured that out. Auto the other side of the cobble, Jay? Well, that one's just cobble, I don't really need to auto the other side of that. I got picked. This is therapy. I sit here and I watch YouTube videos with my hand on the damn you know, button. Um, actually, there is kind of a story behind it. Um, basically, I've worked like almost my whole life, I guess, since I've ever had a job in kitchens. You know, as like a, a cook or one, you know, form or another, as some form of kitchen employee. Uh, so, a, I wanted uh, something that represented that. I guess is the best way to put it and we use these things that uh, we use scoops and the scoops are labeled you know they're they're different sizes and various sizes whatever so I wanted to use something that you know it just sounded cool I don't know like four ounce like that four ounce scoop like uh, it was something that was very common in my world so I wanted to use something that was kitchen related uh, I thought that was cool. I actually tried other ones. I tried blue scoop, green scoop, gray scoop because they're colored too. So, but turns out that those are actually already like not available. Like those names aren't available. So, I got down to four ounce scoop with, uh, you know, the underscore because there was actually a five ounce scoop. There's a five ounce scoop somewhere on Twitch, and uh, thankfully there also isn't a. Uh, I got rid of the underscore, so now it's just four on scoop, all one word. Uh, thankfully, that wasn't still available. <coughs> but yeah, <coughs> I wonder if this actually still works. I have an emote. <coughs> I was wondering if it still works. I don't remember what it is. I think it might be capital S. It's not capital S. <coughs> I wonder if I did it backwards. Was it four ounce, maybe? Oh, I can't remember. I had an emote. <laughs> I can't remember what it is. No way to review your remotes, is there? I wonder if they got rid of the emote. Slow mode, show mode, action, it's on now. Bummer. Sad face. <laughs> Cool, so this is ridiculously OP at this point. Uh, yeah. I don't even have to do this anymore. <laughs> you get way, way too much sugarcane block. Way, way too much sugarcane block. Speaking of OP, I'm gonna go check out my fishing thing over here. Enderman, tier 2, another blaze chunk, a blizz chunk, guardian chunk, salts chunk, this thing just flowering oak sapling. Because those characters have a phoenix, right? Pointless alliteration? I eh, know. Hey, there's got to be some kind of, you know, input. You know, as long as there's at least some kind of story, I guess that's all that really matters. You're not just going in there and just calling yourself, you know, like... Like, some people get creative with it just because it sounds cool, or, you know, somebody's actually got, like, a, an actual story behind it. I, I think each way, either way is, you know, valid. 
Alliteration is a cool thing. I actually want kind of considering just dropping the, the scoop parts and just calling myself four ounce because most people just call me four ounce anyways or scoop and I think four ounce just looks cooler just the 40z but a lot of places don't allow you to have uh, just a three a three letter name kind of thing but glitched out cow nice oh willow sapling is willow still green is willow still green I want I want some green wood And this doesn't have ore excavator, but it does have tree chopper. So if you have an axe, it will basically vein mine the tree for you. It does have tree simulator, but the tree simulator only works on vanilla trees and not on anything else. We'll see. I just keep coming over and looking at it because it's just it's just amazing to see all the crap in here. This is like the world's like greatest thing. <laughs> it's a mob it's a mob spawner. It's like a mob, you know, farm. And uh so you can't get ender pearls. You're not getting ender pearls from this. So I guess that's alright. If you got ender pearls and blaze rods from this, which you kind of do, because you get these blaze shards and uh, these ender shards, so you can make blaze rods, ender, you can make uh, pearls, and you can make gas tears from these. Yeah, never mind, you get those too. Eggs, I'm getting eggs. <laughs> I have no chickens, but I'm getting eggs. I have no animals at all, and I have more meat than I know what to do with my meat. My meat, my meat. Uh, okay. Ton of clay, even more dirt, more sand. Ooh, bone meal. That's what I wanted. Bone meal. I want to grow this willow. Come on. Yes, nice. Oh, that's the pretty willow, too. Don't oh my god, me. You get pears from willows. You get peaches from mahogany trees, you get pears from willows. And you get green wood. Damn right, green wood. Oh, it's got chunks on it. What are the chunky things? Oh, I don't like it now. What are these things? Why? Why would you do that? Harvest? You mean the like the tree thing? Yeah, maybe I have to chisel it. I don't know why they would ruin it. Why would you ruin perfectly good willow wood like that? Uh, where's my iron? There it is. Let's make a chisel. Sure, let's do that. Do I have any strings? No, uh, strings. Strings? Yeah. Do I have any strings? Oh, you suck. It's got like leaves on it or something. Oh, that's so lame. Why do you gotta ruin the freaking wood? Why? Why you gotta ruin it? You made a bow? Good job, Goose. I'm a little upset about that. I'm a little upset about that. What else we got in here? Jungle. I don't want any jungle wood. Umbrin. I don't know what Umbrin looks like. Let's plant an Umbrin. Is 
So Parvis lets you do that thing? That's weird. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know much about Parvis. Um, why? Why do they do this? To, why would you do this? Why would you make it different? Uh, just on the top. Very disappointed in some of these choices. This wood looks cool, though. I can dig this, though. Planks just suck. Is there, like, a tr tree farm? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, because... The crops don't work with the tree growing simulator, yeah. Speaking of which, what is going on down here? This thing still hasn't grown and I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with it. Like, I don't know... Do I plant a seed? Am I supposed to be planting something on this thing? What was that mod called? Was it Attained Drops? I think it was Attained Drops is what it was called. Attained Drops mod. Did that, did that, did that. Craft a mob drop plant seed and plant them on the mod, did that. Right click on Vitalize with a hostile mob drop or bare hand for chat info, okay? Craft mob drop plant seeds. Bone meal plant away. Oh, I gotta get the seed. I think that's why they give you two. Make a, make a windmill. I think that's why they give you two. Holy Christ, dude. This thing is almost full again. It's almost full already. It's over halfway full. And I bet you I only have, like, two blocks of iron. Growing blaze bulb. That's why they give you two... Supposed to grow a bulb now or something, I think. Bone meal plant, or wait for it to fully mature. Fully mature one can be broken for seeds. Once fully mature, the plant will sprout bulbs on top that correspond to the drop in the soil underneath. There's a chance that the vitalized soil may revert to dirt. Planters slowly revert to dirt. So these things will turn back in the dirt if I don't use them? That kind of sucks. found chocolate milk? I, I don't know what to do with the bulbs. Like, I don't know what to do with the bulbs.
that's a prisoner of the prisoner of the prisoner Plants to grow. I don't. I don't know what to do with the bulbs. <laughs> it says, "Great, there you go. You get bulbs," but it doesn't say what to do with them. Like I'm guessing, it just turns into you. Just take the bulbs and it turns into things. Fourteen blocks of iron. Yeah, that's not bad. Ten diamonds. Nice. I somehow got a gold ingot. I'm guessing probably from the pigmen. Or I'm getting way too much redstone. I can disable that in the audio settings. I, I have no uh, other than when it says item plops. <laughs> That's the only time I like it. Like a music and sounds? Oh, show subtitles. Okay. What, well, baby? The squid floated into the chocolate milk and floated down. Squid floated in the chocolate milk and floated down. Nice. This. I want to know what mod does this. This little ender pouch right here? It's like a ender chest built into the GUI. It's pretty nice. I like it. Uh, we're gonna turn these into blocks. Lava gen. I'd like this thing down here to grow, so I know what the heck it is. Oh, there! Look, you did one. Okay, I got a bulb. It's got fancy little particles. Do I break it? Oh, you break it and it gives you a blaze rod. Oh, okay. So we'll plant another one. All right. That vitalized soil, though, is not cheap. I will say that it's two diamonds for that crap. At least two diamonds. Um. Uh, what? How about growth? Is there anything that will help things grow? Growth accelerator that only works for mystical agriculture. Ooh, I could do some of those things too. You made a windmill already? Use a CF to make plants grow around you. What the heck is CF? Charge in an energizer and in your hand use a CF. Crystal flux, that's what CF is. Energizer. I haven't made an energizer in a long time. I'd also like to make one of these. For light sources, so I don't have to use torches. Now that I have an RF source. Uh, do you have any animals? Yeah. You should make a farm for your animals. Yeah, we should make a farm for them, like a barn.
You know what we should probably do? We should probably, since this has refined storage, maybe try to get into refined storage. That way we can consolidate everything. Yeah, there's no root. Uh, small to medium storage crate upgrade. You make a medium storage crate. Put planks around it, and it gives you a small to medium storage crate upgrade. Interesting. No, no progressive. I'd like something that would chop down trees. So it's heat in progress. Tree farm. Tesla powered thingies. What is that? Tesla powered thingies. Test all in one machine. Animal farm, animal gym, animal releaser, a crop cloner. What the hell's a crop cloner do? Steve's carts? Is that what you're talking about, Steven Train Mod? <laughs> Electric Butcher? Is this like. This is like MFR. Except Tesla powered thingies. Item liquefier. Powder maker. Tree farm. Sewer. Powered kiln. Fluid burner. Fluid solidifier. An electric butcher. Tesla battery. Powder base add on. So does this have to run on something that creates Tesla? Ooh, there was another thing that I wanted to look at. I want to see if I can just make it, because it looks like it's kind of neat. A particle cylinder from NICE. I want to make a blue one. Glass panes. I have no idea what this is. I just want to make it. Just want to see what it does. Uh, no clue what any of it is. Dude, I'm gonna have to turn this thing off. <laughs> what is what is that? Hold on, what was that? Oh, it's a rabbit's foot. Dude, I haven't even gotten a rabbit's foot in vanilla. Make a tree farm with it? I might want to try one of these things. Uh, give me some... These Tesla powered things look interesting. It's like MFR, it feels like. Some of the name of the... Some of the... Some of the name of some of the... The names of some of the... Things. It says... Select with the item to change. The item is not consumed. Diamond for sparkles, water bucket for bubbles, bowl for smoke, fish for fish. Let's, let's do fish. That's cooked fish. I bet you I can't use cooked fish. Do I put it down first? Ooh. What the? What? What? What is this? <laughs> what is this? I don't know what it is though. It like creates like holograms. It's like a little fish tank. I don't know what what is it for. What is it for? <laughs> I don't know what it's for. It's 
so cute. You can make so block versions too. It's so cute. It's a particle block. Oh, I'm so making some more of these things. Just because. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. That's how you do it. Vanilla style. I need a. Uh, I definitely wouldn't mind a faster furnace, that's for sure. I don't, I don't get it. I just don't understand what this is for. And why did the cylinders show up like this? You think they'd be cooler going up and down? Can you break them? Can you place it? You can place it up and down. You can change, you can change the colors of them. All right, they don't consume the thing, so I want to see what the sparkles is. Oh! <laughs> Wait, there's wool too. You can do wool. Look at the sparkles. You can do smoke. What was the other one? Water bucket. No, oh, the bubbles are awesome. I'm sorry, the bubbles are probably my favorite. Coach fish? Nope. <laughs> but you can eat it. You can eat it. I'm so making the walls. This functions the, like the way I want it to. lag it would cause if this was a uh, like your floor It's so random. <laughs> it's so random. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what I don't know what to do with that, but this is this has got loads of loads of possibilities. If you could turn these into slabs, that'd be even cooler. Stairs? You imagine stairs like that? That'd be awesome. Oh. <laughs> it's called nice. The mod is called nice. And that's all it is, it's just these. A transparent block. Oh god, you can make it transparent.
Oh, it's not nighttime. I want to get rid of the rain. The rains are mess. The rain's messing up my bubbles. That would be super trippy. Party house. If you just had like a wall full of sparkles and bubbles and stuff. What is that? Oh, gray wool. 22! Holy, holy lapis. Jesus. So much aluminum. So much aluminum. I got a name tag. Skeleton skull. You know, all sorts of crap. What can you do with these things? I know you can make a thing out of this stuff, but I don't. I've never seen anybody do it. They'll buy them a plenty of jewels. Particle blocks are cool. I will not lie, the particle blocks are cool. Ebony sapling, you're next. If your wood, if your wood is like white, that'd be cool. Uh, doesn't look like your wood is white. Wait, ebony's not <laughs> ebony's not white. <laughs> I'm thinking ivory. Oh, it's totally black. That's freaking awesome. All right, no, I can dig this. This is nice. I like this. Ebony, what it is? I have found my floor. I can just get more than one sapling. I think I got two. I think I got another one in there. Yeah, I got another one in there. Ghost tree? Is there a ghost tree? There's a ghost orchid. This has the plants mod in it. It's a freaking sky block. Enderman. I want to make one of the, uh... Dense, the other ones, not the survivalist trainer. There's a different one that lets you get uh, the solid survivalist trainer. Lets you get like wither chunks. Reinforced survivalist trainer. This thing looks badass. Enchantable. Dude, they're gonna make an enchantable one? I think they all get the same drops, honestly. 
I think it's just a different percentage and or just a different amount of uses and efficiency. <clears throat> like this one, this one only gets this. That's all you're gonna get. These all seem to be getting the same things. That one says it can get those too. Hmm. Rice seeds. Hey, does the uh, biomes of oh, lag spike? Nice. The biomes of plenty. Do the biomes of plenty redwoods need like the Natura redwoods? Are they like that? Can you plant them solo? Did I really not get a sapling from that? I really didn't get a sapling from that. Awesome. Like, do these, can you plant these solo? Or do they need to be like a four by four? Cause I've yet to be able to get one to grow. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't get any saplings from that. That's a load of horse crap. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave these here. Use this stuff. What is a terrestrial artifact for? It is for a biome finder. Really? That's it? That's all that's good for? That's all that's good for. What is lapidary calibration? Oh, no. Numismatic dynamo. Welcome back, Stuart. Numismatic requires currency? It's like asking. Currency? I was say numismatic is is uh the collecting uh coins. There's a there's a numismatic dynamo? Is it like run on it runs on coins. <laughs> Thermal Foundation coins. It runs on coins. Or an emerald. <laughs> or an emerald. Such a weird thing. How do you make the coins? You need a compactor mint. Ooh, mint. Compactor. Impresses items and augments numismatic. And then you need one of these things. So one block of Enduria makes 27 coins. One ingot makes three coins. That's such a weird thing. Fishing rods. Remember when this playthrough started, I needed a freaking fishing rod. Oh god, they're invisible. There it is. <laughs> Put them in here. What's this number four for? Uh. For how many? 
cow chunk. That's what it's for. Okay. Um, I want to go down and look at this thing down here. If I can get down this thing, thank mm -hmm. you. I need to plant a seed on that. Give me my blaze rod. Give me my blaze rod. <laughs> Give me my blaze rod. <laughs> uh, actually, we're just going to replant this. So that grows kind of quick, actually, once it's fully grown. There we go. Since we get two seeds from the recipe, let's do two. Uh, attained. Apple and seeds, that's right. Any seed. Apple. Uh, I don't know if it's any seed. You do need to kill mobs, though, to get these things. These things you can't get from your little cobble gin thing over there. Oh, dirt. Mm -hmm. I only needed one. Uh, I that. And lots of bone meal. Lots of bone meal. Lots of bone meal. This will get me six. Where did all these blaze shards come from? Thirty-two diamonds. Jesus, man, this thing is so OP. And it really didn't take like much resource-wise to do any of this crap. Like it's pretty basic stuff. Down the rabbit hole. Me some bulbs. Yeah, you know when when you can't have a an autonomous activator. Yeah, when you can't have an autonomous activator or anything from uh, open blocks, that's your next best bet. This isn't gonna give me a sapling, is it? I'm gonna be really mad. Thank you for giving me one freaking sapling. Do this wood. Did you get the big trees? This wood is awesome. Look, it's black on the inside. You should call it black concrete. Uh, actually, it's called ebony. Ebony wood. Because ebony is black. And there's a slime island over there. I need to go over there at some point. And grab that stuff. What's in here flight-wise? Flight. Oh yeah, that stuff. Elite Ender Pearl lets you fly. Reusable Ender Pearl. Well, that's cheap enough. How does this work? How does this work? Inactive Ender Core. Ender Alloy Obsidian. Ender Alloy. Block of Redstone. That's easy. Elite Ender Pearl Reusable. How does this work? Ender Alloy. It's pretty cheap. How does this work? <laughs> I just want to keep saying how this works. How does this work? Right click an ender crystal to activate. In the end. 
Oh, oh wait, well, it says you need an inactive one. It doesn't say you need an active one. You have to go to the end to do that, I guess. But that's that's an inactive ender core. I want to make this. <laughs> I want to make this. This just lets you fly, but it probably doesn't. Like it, it, it probably sorta, like kinda, maybe looks like something that lets you fly. Like, it's probably more like, lets you die from fall damage. Is this thing still going? Yeah, it's still going. Jesus. I got a weather skull. This is, oh wait, I betcha cooking it generates more RF. You fly with it? Well that's what I was saying, like, so if you, if you're on a sky block, it's not really flying, it's more just, you just kind of go where it goes. So like if you stood over here and threw it over there, like, if you threw it straight up in the air, you'd go straight up in the air, but like you can't, it's not creative flight. That's what I'm getting at, it's not creative flight, that's what I'm getting at. There's a bow. Life steel and flame. It's not a bad bow. What you doing, Goose? Yeah. Just go easy on the treats. One thing I don't have a lot of. Coal. I don't have a lot of coal, and I'm constantly. I need a tree farm. Okay. Uh, I think tree farm's next. <laughs> they fly like an arrow. That's kind of cool, though. That would be really cool on on the ground, but not in the air. Not in the air. Um, I think a tree farm is next. I think we need to set up a tree farm. This thing is full too. There's stuff in here too. Just because this thing can't keep up. stone that I know what to do with. I need a furnace that I can power with my culinary generator. That's what I need. That's something I need, I think. I need a furnace. What is that? That one looks pretty. Redstone furnace. Superium furnace. There's the furnace that I just made from extra utilities that I could use. Not the furnace generator. The ultimate furnace. Three seconds per item in normal mode, one second in fast. Can use ender pearls, eyes of ender, and blaze powders fuel in addition to the normal furnace fuels. 
can also use lava as fuel from fluid containers, such as the underbucket or portable tanks. Can operate without fuel when item per 60 seconds. Slow mode cooks one and a half times the items per fuel compared to a vanilla furnace. Fast mode uses fuel six times faster than slow mode over time. 0.75 times the items per fuel versus vanilla. Can output directly to the owner's vanilla ender chest. Can operate without fuel. It cooks one item per 60 seconds. One item a minute without fuel. That's kind of cool. Goose, what are you doing over there? I'm hearing lots of noises. Alright, maybe we'll just do a normal furnace first. <laughs> we'll do a normal furnace first. And then, uh... Then we'll see what happens. <laughs> Speed upgrade of the transfer node would be good, yes. Pair my boots. But honestly, because of, of this, we're gonna need storage. We're definitely gonna need storage because of this. need storage. Twenty four thousand RF forty are up a tick. Raw fish does what? Raw fish does 1600 RF at 16 RF a tick. Yeah, so much better. Cook fish much better. What I like about that, that ender generator is that it can run without fuel. It's almost like uh, just put some stuff in it and then you can kind of forget about it kind of thing. You don't ever have to worry about powering it kind of just have it be like I could use that pump wood from a tree farm in it and just have like endless charcoal that I just never have to worry about it just cooks it automatically that would be perfect uh, furnace furni have much ender pearls but I got a ton of these things which that's their only use and there's probably like a stack yeah there's a stack and some in here holy crap look at that more than 16 in a stack. Holy crap. Holy crap. Goose, what are you doing over there? You need to answer me. You're making lots of noise. I don't know what you're doing. Okay, but I don't know what all that noise is that you're doing. Yeah, all that clicking noises. I don't know what that is. Thanks for... No, it sounds like you're opening and closing something. Alright. What are you doing?
anything anymore. The Potion Bears mod? I, it doesn't tell you anything. I looked at it. It doesn't tell me anything. Like, I don't know what it is. You just make Potion Bears? I mean, you just drink them? Like, what is it? Is it a one-time use? And what's the activated mean? What does activated mean? Like, I gotta look it up. I don't know what it means. There's a bear stick. What's a bear stick for? When there's bears around, you can keep them away or leave them Is there a flight? Is there a flight one? <laughs> Invisibility, luck, instant health, glowing, water breathing, health boost, fire resistance, speed. Wither, Absorption, Hunger, Haste, Jump Boost, Strength, Regen, Levitation. Is it, it's, it's just wool, right? It's just wool and terracotta. What's the activated mean? I want to know what activated means. I know what activated means. You know what activated means? like turning on. Like you turn it on, you activate it. And then turning off. I don't have any... Oh, I don't have any cobble on me. And the cobble Only if you're good, okay? You don't start doing shady things over there, then I don't know what you're doing. When I come over there and look, you get all nervous and start putting things away. It'll be good. It's got my name in it. We're gonna sit here and stare at it. Fast mode, slow eco mode. Look at it, it's working. It's actually working with nothing in it. So it'll do this once a minute. That's, that's like... There's something really cool about that, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Solar Flux Reborn. I still want to know how to get gravel ores. Alright, I'll get you an iron nugget. How do I get cobalt? You gotta make a cobalt chemical ore dust. How do you make a cobalt chemical ore dust? Glowstone and lapis. Go so and I will make cobalt. 
Yeah, the mystical agriculture has good everything. Like, I definitely want the supremium armor. But this, oh, I would need, I would probably need like four or five of these things going. <laughs> I would need a massive, a massive ma uh, farm uh, for essence with, it's all nickel ore, Jesus. I would need a massive essence farm, and I don't have an under IO farmer, so I'd have to find some other farmer. Uh, what was the tree? Is that a Christmas tree? Twinkling Christmas tree sapling. Really? Really? I need grass. I need to make some grass. Certain seeds I'm doing it. I need a grass block. Give me a grass block, please. Look, I have grass. I <laughs> I got grass from from the strainer. Uh, seeds. That's what I needed. Four seeds. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's got it's got all those other things. It's got those MFR things, those Tesla things. But I, I think I'm gonna mess with. I really want to know what a clop, a clop, a clock cloner. I want to know what a crop cloner is. Um, this has or an animal gym. What is an animal gym? Uh, crop farm. It's got a crop farm. Uh, and it's got an incinerator. That sounds cool. It's got a tree, a tree farm. Where is it? Tree farm. It's even got a sewer. That's why I'm thinking like MFR, like it's got the sewer too. But it's got a tree farm. I just don't know what it needs to run on. Dung bricks. It's got a Tesla battery. Speed upgrade. Like, I don't see... It's got a creative generator, but I don't see a regular generator. Multi-tank, liquid XP. Like, I don't see anything that would say Tesla generator. So I don't know if it'll work. Uh, okay, so I need... I need the seeds in this hand. I need this in my inventory. Is that how this works? I forgot how this works. Life infusion. Blah blah blah. The item above the shield is the one that goes in the off hand. Fusion stone is held in your main hand. The block is a block you click on with the fusion stone. Okay. Bam. Grass block. I also want silk touch at some point. Um, okay. Uh, we're past about two hours. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna probably try to make a tree area or something uh, between now and then. Uh, this thing is freaking ridiculous. I'm, I'm just gonna turn this off. <laughs> I'm gonna turn that off for a second. Uh, this is just nuts. I need some kind of form of storage, so... <clears throat> Maybe, maybe refined storage? Maybe? Or maybe big wall of, big wall of drawers? I don't know. But, uh, uh, I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate uh, the follows and the hosts and whatnot. And I appreciate you guys put up all my derpiness. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh,
I'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow morning again, probably around 11ish, because um, I have tomorrow off, so yay me. And uh, yeah, no, right? Good amount, good amount of material to start something, right? I got a ton of aluminum. What can I make out of aluminum? Uh, thank you for watching. Ooh, I could make alumite. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow, and uh, y'all have a good day. Later, y'all.